there's a whole set of instructions that we need to talk about before somebody can eat a Juicy Lucy for the first time. It may look like a burger on the outside, but inside, there's something you can normally only find in the Midwest. This was uh, invented in Minneapolis in the 50s. It's a cheese stuffed burger, sort of like a lava burger. This is a Juicy Lucy. It's a lot of cheese. <laughs> The star of Lucy's Burger Bar. Special, yeah. A bubbly river of cheese oozes out the center of your burger as you're eating it. How did this Midwest staple make it to the mountains? Yeah. Well, you can thank owner and Minnesota native Michelle McLone. Yeah. <laughs> My longtime close friend Nate is from Min Minneapolis, and he worked the grill at Matt's, which is one of the places said to be home of the original Juicy Lucy. Really wanted to bring like a thousand square feet of Minneapolis and just plunk it down into Denver. And a bonus reason to eat here, Lucy's Burger Bar is community focused. We are only carrying products on our bar menu from companies that are also woman owned, POC owned, and give to animals, the environment, and uh, LGBTQ. The big question, how do you eat a Juicy Lucy? You don't want to bite into it like a normal burger because it's not a normal burger. I'm gonna take a tiny little bite, let the bubbly river of cheese ooze out, and then uh, enjoy it slowly. For Nine News Mornings, I'm Victoria Valenzuela. Mm.